just speaking to the severity of the incident and how many people's lives it's touched. William Sutton represents the family of five-year-old Ulysses Rodriguez Montoya. He's one of two people killed in last month's school bus crash on State Highway 21 in Bastrop County. Sutton says his focus is ensuring another family doesn't experience the same sorrow. Through this process, we should be able to uncover a lot of answers and see what we can do about changes that hopefully can be made to make sure this doesn't happen again. The lawsuit filed this week by the Rodriguez Montoya family is the sixth one against Jerry Hernandez and FJM Concrete, which employed him. A suit filed Wednesday by the family of 33-year-old Ryan Wallace brings the total number of lawsuits so far to seven. Ulysses' family is citing multiple instances of negligence as well as wrongful death by Hernandez. And holding each of those people responsible civilly uh, for negligence and in some cases gross negligence is critical. In total, the family is seeking more than $1 million in damages. You could pick a number that's very high and it still probably wouldn't be enough. Enough to Hayes County Judge Ruben Becetta looks like changes to the stretch of highway where this crash happened. Build a proper safe four lane Highway 21 with a dividing barrier so this won't happen again. Sutton says while the family hasn't specifically asked his firm to investigate that stretch of road, he says they're looking into everything for this case. Uh, anything that can possibly be done to keep people safer on this road. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.